Some questions about the care of animals in the canine unit of the Liberty County Sheriff's Office. It comes after one of the dogs that appeared to be unwell was turned over to a shelter. WSAV's Kaylee Fetko reports now from Liberty County. I'm here at Liberty County Animal Control, where last week a retired Liberty County canine Kona was held temporarily after being released from the care of her handler, a Liberty County Sheriff's deputy. This is retired canine Kona in what appears to be unwell condition. It's pretty clearly evident that somewhere along the way the ball was dropped in the proper care of this dog. She was under the care of her handler, Liberty County Sheriff's Deputy Trevor Tolson, until Monday, April 29th, when the Sheriff's Office says he surrendered her. This launching an investigation into the canine division. Hinesville veterinarian Dr. Rachel Peoples says in her expert opinion, Kona appears to may be underweight in these photos obtained by News 3. Whether neglect was a factor, Dr. Peoples says the proper steps to care for Kona may not have been taken. There are reasons that she would be underweight that would not have been preventable, and there's reasons that she was underweight that would have been preventable. Either way, noticing her being underweight should have happened, and she should have sought veterinary care to figure out the problem. In a news release, the sheriff's office says any allegations of mistreatment or neglect are taken very seriously. This is not the first time in recent months the canine division ran into problems. In late March, the sheriff's office, along with the Georgia Bureau of Investigation, looked into claims of two canine supervisors falsifying training documents, which led to both of their resignations. Caring for dogs daily in Liberty County, People says she believes changes need to be made in how canines are cared for here. I think we really need to look across the board at how we treat and how we serve our canine officers and maybe do a little bit better job and maybe give them the same love and dedication that they give to us. Liberty County Animal Control's director telling me Kona was released within less than 24 hours of her arrival and has since found a new handler. He also says she was in good condition. The Liberty County Sheriff's Office did not provide a timeline for the investigation, but said they are committed to maintaining a strong canine unit. Reporting in Liberty County, Kaylee Fedko, WSAB News 3, on your side.